great. Oh my god. I'm done. Cut the show. I'm done. Take me off. Girl, hey, it's Station A. You talk about the way I look or sound, your mother is a whore, okay? I don't feel good. I feel like dick water, and I had such a good idea to shoot. I feel like dick water, and I had such a good video. Oh, God, I can't speak. I feel like dick water, and I had such a fun idea. I feel like dick water, and I had such a fun video idea to film. I feel like dick water and I had such a fun video idea to film today, but I don't feel good. So instead of doing that, we're going to do a sick day guide to feeling better. <clears throat> Bitch, I cannot sound like somebody saw this whole video. Like, I really can't. Drink some water or something. Holy f I just woke up. It is like 12 o'clock and I also have plans tomorrow with friends around 4. So I have a little more than 24 hours to get my together because I want to be outside doing hood rat sh with my friends tomorrow. Yes, but I wanted to do hood rat stuff for my friends. I'm going to show you guys everything I do when I don't feel good to try to help myself feel better. I'm going to get up, go to the bathroom, take Luna to the bathroom, shower, and then I will be back. One hour later. Okay, we are back. It is a little bit after one o'clock, so we've showered. We've made ourselves some breakfast. Just some eggs is what I have for breakfast every morning. I made myself breakfast so that I can start step one of my sick day process and taking medicine. Hey, yeah. To be honest, I usually don't like taking medicine, but I am trying to feel better as soon as possible. So we're going to take it. I am taking Dayquil and then I am also taking Alka-Seltzer. I usually like the... Um, emergency better than alka because i feel like it tastes better but the alka works better so we're taking that today okay so first we have day quill oh my god these things are so hard to open like give me it i don't feel good bitch give me it i've got fucking clinical depression you fucking idiot day quill taking them with orange juice for extra vitamin c and then we're gonna take Alka-Seltzer. Yeah, double homicide. Bitch. I love listening to these dissolve in the water. Ready? Oh, little Bruh. ASMR. So good. <laughs> the way I'm watching this is insane. You better make me feel better, you little bitches. <laughs> okay, I think it's all dissolved. So we're gonna drink it now. I don't like the way this one tastes. Emergency tastes so much better. So if you're not in a rush to feel better, I would recommend emergency. But if you're in a rush to feel better, I recommend Alka-Seltzer. Alka-Seltzer, am I saying it right? Al Alka-Seltzer. What? <laughs> Bro, what are you talking about? Anyway, cheers. You nasty. Oof. Oh my god. I am feeling like I want to die and that this is complete torture and I don't know what I did to somebody to make me sit here and do this. Yeah, take it as quickly as possible because it's not good. Some of it's like stuck on the bottom. I need all of it. Oh. Okay. Oh, so disgusting. Okay, first dose is done. It says that you can take them every four hours, but that's a bit much even for me in my circumstances. I'm just gonna take them every eight hours, but first dose is done. Next thing I wanna do is get rid of all the germies. I've been feeling well for the last few days, so I feel like my room is just like filled with germs. So I'm gonna do some laundry. We just need to get all the germs away. A few moments later. Okay, as you can see, the bed sheets are in. The washer now. My brain is not working. Like every time I go to try to. Hello? Every time I go to try to talk, I either mumble my words and my sentences, or I can't think of what I'm gonna say. Like, brain's all over the place today. But anyway, bed sheets are in the wash. Now I'm gonna run to the store because I wanna make myself some tea. But I don't have all the ingredients that I need to make my tea. So I'm gonna run to the store, get everything that I need, and then come back and make some tea. So I'll see you guys once I'm back from the store. One hour later. Okay, 
we just got back from the store so it is time to make tea i just put my comforter in the dryer and i don't know if you can see but i have all of these like white specks on me now i think that my comforter may have ripped in the washer i looked at it while i was putting it in the dryer and i couldn't see any rips but we'll worry about that later i, I don't know so first you're going to get some lemonade and you're going to put equal parts lemonade and water into a pot and heat that up I usually do like a half a cup or a cup of lemonade and then same amount of water either half a cup or a cup i'm gonna do a cup of each this time because i want a lot of tea okay tea or tea lemonade and water in here heating up so I'm gonna wait for that to heat up and then I will be right back. A few moments later. Okay, so the water and lemonade are heated up. So I'm gonna put that in a cup. Yeah, I'm gonna do this over the sink in case I spill. Okay, and then I'm gonna add peach tea and mint tea. When I went to the store, they didn't have regular peach tea, they just had this peach detox. So I got that. I usually just use peach tea though, but. They didn't have any, so I don't work with what we have. One time I was really out of it. I like made eggs and I was gonna put the eggs back and I also had like, I think I brought- Okay, and then I just add some honey to the tea. Are you a tea drinker, Yasmin? I love tea. Do you? I hate tea, that's why I have to mm -hmm. make tea that doesn't really taste like it. A few moments later. Okay, once you add your honey, you're good. That is the tea. So let's give it a little taste test. Actually, I'm about to burn my f mouth. It's way too hot. Yes, absolutely. Mm-hmm. Now that's what I'm talking about. Oh my God. Yes, this is what I needed. I actually need to document this. I'm so proud of myself that I just continued filming while my roommate was in the kitchen with me. Huh? I'm very much a, I don't like people seeing me film. And before I would have absolutely shut off the camera and been like cut the show i'm not doing this video anymore cut the cameras dead ass i was like you know what the show must go on okay people are gonna see me film and i have to be okay with it if i want to be a full-time content creator like it is what the f it is but anyway we have our tea i just put on a movie i have my ipad here because i'm editing a youtube video yes the grind Never stops. I'm editing a video while I'm filming a video. Next step on the sick day checklist is to just relax. So we're just going to drink some tea, watch a movie, edit a video, and I will see you guys in a little bit. Two hours later. Update. We have clean sheets. It's been a few hours. Um, did I watch the Barbie movie? Yes. Did I edit my YouTube video? No. All I want to do is nap, and I can't right now because I have clothes in the dryer, and my building has shared laundry so if somebody touches my shit, i will actually go crazy b i'm sure if someone moved your shit they didn't put it in a dryer with someone else's stuff like common sense if you must move someone's stuff at least put it on top of the dryer people with normal decorum and decency that's what they would do who raised you so i have to wait until my stuff is dry and i get it and then i can take a nap but i can't edit right now because i'm just i don't feel good and i'm, I'm too tired to even do it i am absolutely mentally spiritually physically tired so we're gonna just wait until our clothes are dry i'm gonna finish the barbie movie and then i'm gonna take a nap because again a part of the sick day checklist is to rest and I, I want to be unconscious. I don't feel good. And one of my favorite things to do when I don't feel good is to sleep because I'm unconscious and I don't know I don't feel good. You know what I mean? So, yeah. I just want to go to sleep. Also, I don't think my um, comforter, I genuinely cannot with words today. My comforter isn't um, ripped. What is wrong with me? Have you ever had a dream that that you um you had you you, you i when i was making my bed i didn't see any rips in it so thankfully i don't think it's ripped one eternity later okay guys finally my clothes are dry that is them in their um laundry bag i really can't talk today i'll fold that later but i was really waiting for this my bonnet because i need to take a nap i'm so tired my lips are trapped, I'm looking crusty. I just need to go to sleep. So I'm gonna take a little nap, give my body whatever it needs, and I will talk to you guys after. Much, much, much later. 
I'm extremely confused. I just took the fattest fucking nap in the world. It's like 10 p.m. I'm about to eat and come back to sleep because I just, I'm feeling better, but I just want to sleep. I don't want to do anything else. I don't know if I said this earlier, but another thing on the sick day checklist, staying hydrated. I drank like three of these today. Oh my God, I literally sound like somebody's son. That's insane. Can I live? Can I fucking live? Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. But only do that stuff if you are the sickest bitch in your city. Not the sickest bitch in your city. Don't worry about it. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace and love. Talk to you later.